After a long conflict between Ukraine and Russia, the U.S. has previously donated its advanced weapons to Ukraine such as Patriot anti-missile systems and others. This time, we will discuss a pretty terrible and very sophisticated weapon from the U.S. that is M2 Bradley. Will the U.S. contribute it to Ukraine as well? Before that, let's find out what M2 Bradley is. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment, and also activate the bell to get the latest information from this channel. What is M2 Bradley? The M2 Bradley or Bradley IFV is an American infantry vehicle manufactured as part of the Bradley fighting vehicle family. Like other infantry vehicles, the Bradley is designed to transport infantry with armored protection and can provide protective fire to suppress enemy forces. The M2 can carry three crew members, a commander, a gunner, and a driver, as well as six infantry soldiers. What is the use of M2 Bradley in war? Bradley's mission is to provide mobile transport of an infantry squad to critical points on the battlefield and perform cavalry missions. The M2 will also provide protective fire to support descending infantry and to suppress or defeat enemy tanks and other combat vehicles. The M2 Bradley is a fully armored vehicle designed to carry infantry to close proximity to the enemy. The M2 has enough mobility to keep up with the Abrams battle tank, medium and long range weapons are capable of defeating all vehicles on the battlefield and enough armor to protect the crew from artillery and small arms threats. The M2 is named after General Omar Bradley, known as the GI General during World War II. How strong is this weapon? The Bradley is a formidable vehicle. It has teeth in the form of high-powered machine guns and anti-tank missiles. This weaponry is used to provide protective fire for the troops it transports, as well as to suppress and destroy enemy tanks. Combined with its speed and agility, the Bradley is well equipped to combat enemy vehicles. The M2's main armament is the 25mm M242 Bushmaster gun that can fire up to 200 rounds per minute and an accuracy rate of up to a distance of 2500M depending on the ammunition used. AP armor piercing, or he high explosive. The M2 is also armed with twin missiles in a rectangular compartment on the left side capable of destroying tanks for a maximum range of 3750M. However, the missile can only be fired when the vehicle is stationary. Both Bradley models also have twin BGM-71 TOW anti-tank missile launchers mounted on the left side of the turret. TO is an acronym that stands for Target Sensitive, Optically Tracked, Wire Guided Missile. Optical sights are used to track each target. After firing the missile, the launch sends flight data to the missile guidance system. The missile can hit any target within 2.33 miles, 3.75 kilometers. The M2 carries 7 BGM-71 TOW anti-tank missiles, and the M3 carries 12. Aluminum's use and storage of large amounts of ammunition inside the vehicle initially raised questions about its combat capabilities. The M2 Bradley is highly capable in open terrain, in accordance with one of the main goals of the M2 design in order to be in line with the M1 Abrams battle tank. The Bradley was originally designed to float by opening the float curtains around the vehicles, but this led to several cases of drowning due to failure during the first attempt. The upgrade of the M2 armor has made this ability impossible. 